having dinner with the guys last night and just kind of settling down, uh, getting ready for this road trip? Yeah, it was uh, nice to get away for a little bit. Uh, kind of an artificial way to reset things, you know, get, get in a different situation, different atmosphere. Uh, guys came to the rink ready to work today. Nobody's down, so a uh, big challenge. You know, we know they're coming off a tough game last night, so they're going to be a hungry team, and, and our game has to get better uh, to the point where we're, we're winning these games. Regardless if they play or not, is there any sort of boost to the spirit seeing a guy like Leon and Drake on the ice with the team and getting back into skating? Yeah, I mean, we're not we're not relying on those guys to come back. Uh, you know, we got to figure it out. Some guys got to step up here. But when your group's together, whole again, uh, it feels right. Having those guys out there, sharing some laughs, seeing them work hard, uh, it certainly delivers a bit of a boost. A tired team, maybe, Chicago, uh, for this one. How do you take advantage of that? Is it the first 10 minutes, the first shift? Like, what do you yeah. want to do? You know, I, I, don't, I don't view them as a tired team. I mean, it's pretty early in the year. Uh, you know, everybody's pretty well conditioned now, so they'll be ready to do it. They're a veteran team. They've been through that kind of stuff. But the start's always big, especially the, the circumstances that were around last game for us getting down early. Uh, we know in this building, uh, you get the fans involved early with a you know a good start for them, and make it for a long night. So we, we have to be ready from the start, make sure we're we're going, and, and hopefully uh, put some pressure on them early.